Hi everyone, it's Christopher, Mono County Library Director and co-host of the Oxygen Starved Podcast. It's Book Talk Friday and I have a couple of excellent library books for you to check out today. The first is for young people. The Assassination of Brangwain Spurge came out in 2018 and was written and illustrated by two award-winning authors, M.T. Anderson and Eugene Yelchin. It tells the story of an elf, Spurge, who is given the assignment of traveling to a kingdom no elf has ever returned from alive, the land of the evil goblins. He is to give a present to the king of the goblins and report back everything he can learn about this dastardly race. The story is written by Anderson and illustrated by Yelchin. Without giving the creative and humorous story away, I will mention that, you know, one would expect when someone from one culture visits another and they both harbor all sorts of cliches and stereotypes about each other, misunder can, misunderstandings can happen and hijinks ensue. One delightful aspect to this book, which received every starred review it could and was a finalist for the National Book Award, is the brief author's note at the end in which Anderson and Yelchin teasingly describe why they wrote this book for young people. It's a story about the difference between cultures, assumptions versus real understanding, a story that asks the age-old question, why do goblins always get the bad rap? You also learn that Yelchin was raised in Soviet Russia, which clearly informs some of their motives and also leads me to my pick for the newer title this week. The Genius Under the Table, Growing Up Behind the Iron Curtain by Eugene Yelchin came out about a year ago, and this has also received glowing reviews. It's also for middle schoolers. It's a brief memoir describing the period of his life as a child living with his entire family in a single room in Leningrad. A home so tiny that the furniture had to be rearranged every night, and little Eugene slept underneath his grandmother's dining table. His father loves poetry, his mother works at a ballet school, his older brother excels at figure skating, and his parents are desperate for Eugene to develop a talent that will allow him to eventually leave the cramped home and enjoy the luxuries and perks that Soviet Russia doled out only to the most talented. Being Jewish in this anti-Semitic culture didn't help, nor did the ever-present KGB. Told with wit and humanity, he recounts their daily life, their struggles, and how he would secretly steal his father's pencil each evening to doodle on the underside of the table when he was supposed to be sleeping. Doodles that would help him try to make sense of his world, and one gets the sense, help him develop the talent for illustration and storytelling that he puts to great effect in his books today. In their review, the Hornbook magazine states this title is a forthright, darkly humorous, and indelible portrait of an artist emerging. Yelchin wonderfully allows his text and pictures to interrupt each other with glee, reminding us how life begets art. Great review for a great book, The Genius Under the Table by Eugene Yelchin. Another great book, The Assassination of Bran Wayne Spurge by M.T. Anderson and Yelchin. Both available in Mono County Libraries, along with other titles from both authors. Come in and grab these or another one to read. In the meantime, stay safe and happy reading.